Look at YouTube, how's it going? Uh, back again for doing another video since fucking with this uh, thing that's happened. I've got a lot of free time, so I thought I'd start doing videos. Uh, big shout out to Mad Malco. Caught Malky in another video, didn't like it, gave me a trouble. So check out Brilliant Guy, does good reviews on guitars, loads of interesting guitars, stuff that some of the stuff he's got is really interesting. Uh, I'm going to show you a guitar that I'm not going to play it, but I'll show you that there's you can get it being played on YouTube, uh, but there's no actual review on it of the actual guitar itself. Uh, so we should get that. <coughs> this is a Kingdom Empire series. It's a uh, matte black. Uh, it's pickups on it, or they're not straight, they're angled, which basically means is the treble sounds very trebly, bass sounds very bassy. Uh, it's got cream binding around it, uh, around the headstock as well, black headstock, really crazy metal kind of looking guitar. Uh, it's got the Stratocaster output sort of, and a, for some reason it's got a Fender high mass but I think somebody put this on after it. Basically I think what they're going for was the kind of editing look. Because uh, it is very, it's got that kind of jazz body bottom here and it's got the kind of, uh, it's kind of SG still so I don't think they kind of wanted to copy it like, uh, it's got long start buttons, strange one, black bottom one, silver top one, I actually looked that up, it does come like that, <laughs> bow on neck, a scarf joint, a got diamond inlays, this here is a this tone, that's a two master volumes for obviously each pickup, it's got a midpoint for blending, so you actually feel where the midpoint is, and then it kind of loosens off again, so you can feel the midpoint in it. A nice shape back on it. A really nice looking guitar, but definitely, definitely try to copy the editing. That editing look, and that's what drew me towards this guitar, because I've always wanted one, just when they pay the money. <coughs> uh, says I'm not going to play it, there's no point, there's loads of videos on it uh, getting played on YouTube, I just thought I'd show you because there's no actual review on this. I don't think the company's going anymore, or if it is, it's going out of business because these are supposed to retail at 550 quid, but they're on sale half price on the site for 250 quid. I never paid that for it. <coughs> Definitely I'll pay that for it. <coughs> it's a really nice guitar. I originally wanted to buy it just to get the bridge off it. But I th I'm thinking that I'm going to keep it. And I'm going to keep the bridge off it. Sounds nice. It says go on YouTube. Google it. Kingdom Empire Bass. There's a band. Don't ask me their name. Uh, the bass player's sponsored by Kingdom. Obviously not anymore for the business. But the only thing that puts me off is a scarf joint and neck. <coughs> not a big fan of scarf joints. For the fact I'll show you another guitar. This is my first ever guitar. This is an Avia Pro 2 Madax. Uh, I've replaced the machine heads, a uh, string tree, bridge, pickups, stuff like that. But what happened with this is when I originally bought, I think it was a, I want to say a Westfield B base. Got it all <clears throat> first when it fell out. So I took it back at a, a guitar shop in Glasgow that everybody knows in Glasgow, Victor Morris Southern Guitar Shop. <clears throat> and I got this second hand. Obviously, just swap it because it fell out. <clears throat> but then I bought another one, a black one. Obviously, I bought this because it looks like Dirty David. And I happened to sit it down and it fell. Hit the top of the Headstock snapped the neck clean off right at the scarf joint, and that's why I don't really like guitars. Hey, 
Garth joint headstocks all flat like PB's jazz and stuff. <clears throat> but this is a really nice guitar. Uh, I've replaced bridge buttons, all the electrics are all done. So I just thought I'd geezer a wee video since it's kind of my first time doing videos on YouTube. Uh, it'll be probably guitars, basses, more mostly I've got loads of other basses that I can show you. Uh, and when the summer comes in, I'm back on the bike, it'll be bike related. Uh, I do tours around Scotland, England, Europe. <coughs> uh, so I'll get my bike fitted with a nice camera, front and back, when the low days go out. I'll take videos of that to show you around Scotland and around England and around Europe and stuff. Uh, show you the bikes, uh, all the biker mates, show you all their bikes and stuff. So it'll be a mix, a mix of stuff. Uh, so, hope you like the videos. Please like and subscribe. New to YouTube. Uh, and hope you like it. Thanks very much. Cheers.